Welcome back, everybody. So today, I thought we would try something a little bit different than my last video before we launch back into the spoken word song covers. This week, I was inspired by a PSA that Julia Louis-Dreyfus posted on her Instagram. She is brilliant and hilarious, and I thought that, given that most of you don't actually probably know that I used to be a makeup artist, I would take this opportunity to just walk you through a really quick tutorial on how to accomplish her look from her Instagram video. So I started today by just sort of washing my face and putting a little bit of moisturizer on. Um, you can just start with a clean face. Um, and then we begin. So before we get too far in, I wanna give a quick shout out to my friend Marianne. These brushes are excellent. Um, so I'm gonna start in the eye area with a gray color just to give a bit of a base. There was a really lovely smoky eye in the video that I'm gonna emulate here today. This is just really great for during these times when everybody's at home. If you just need to pop on to a Zoom call or some sort of quick work thing, this is just a really fast look that you can throw on to get yourself feeling a little bit more normal for those work functions. It will actually also then transfer or translate, transition, I guess, really nicely into an evening for when you are then virtually hanging out with your friends. So you just go in with a bit of gray to start with just something light to sort of give a base to the look. I'm gonna then go in over top of that with a black, and you just sort of start in the corner, a bit up around the edges, a bit under the eye, to kind of just highlight certain areas, and just create a bit of drama. The gray, as you will see, just sort of blends out nicely underneath it. Which, you know, do you see? It just kind of, yeah, blends really nicely. So then you sort of try to do the same thing on the other eye. Try to keep things as symmetrical as you can without being too crazy about it because nobody's face is actually that symmetrical. You want to try to make sure that you highlight the crease that's really beneficial. And then a little bit sort of up. So just something nice. Once you're done with that mm, eyeshadow, then you're gonna want to make sure that you finish up that eye with some eyeliner. Now you can use a pencil or you can use a liquid eyeliner. I today am using a black gel eyeliner and so you, again, you just want to get in and you don't necessarily want to do the full bottom part of the eye. You just want to do about half of it and just sort of get in there, do a bit of a light look. You don't want to necessarily do too much. Um, and then if you're feeling really funky, you can wing it out a bit. Just, you know, something nice and simple. Just, it adds a bit of, adds a bit of flair. And then I'll show you on the other eye how you can take it into an evening look. You just go a little bit further in and then you can wing it out even more. Just really, and so that's an easy, it's an easy step to do to get from your day to your night. You can just go in afterwards and really dramatize that wing like so so you see daytime nighttime same look different ampage it's also a good idea to put on it's also a good idea to put on an eyebrow now i'm just going to use the same liner and just do 
some light, just if you do short little strokes, it makes it look like hair, and it gives you a really nice eyebrow line. And you can just sort of go back a little bit and sort of blend it out. So there you go, you've got your eyebrows. After that, it's nice to finish it off with a bit of blush. I'm just gonna use something, because it's quarantine time, because we're just having a bit of fun, I'm gonna just go in with a really nice bright one. Just because it's, you know, just a nice pop of color. And then to complete the look, you're gonna to wanna to throw on some lipstick. Now, a lot of people are gonna tell you that if you're doing a smoky eye, you're not gonna to wanna to do a bright red lipstick, but hey, we're all in quarantine. There are no rules here, so do what you wanna do. So, just a nice, simple, light lipstick. There, and then you can just, just make sure you get the edges. Just connect those lines. And then there you go. So again, just a nice, simple, quick look that you can all throw on really fast before a meeting. Thanks to Julia Louis-Dreyfus for the inspiration. Thanks to Robert for helping me set up my computer. And um, stay safe, everybody. <laughs>